Hey there viewers, today the topic of our video is 32 legitimate ways to make money at home. But before starting the video, if you have not subscribed to my channel Beaming Wink, please make sure to subscribe it. So you're looking for ways to make money from home? Very easy. Thanks to a genius invention called the internet, Americans are discovering more and more creative ways to cushion their bank accounts from the comfort of home. Not sure where to start, pour yourself a cup of coffee or glass of wine and keep watching the video. How to make money from home in 2020. If you're looking to make money online, you'll need to exercise caution. There are a lot of scams out there, but don't fear. We have tested dozens, if not hundreds, of different money-making strategies and included many of our favorite. Yep, none of them involve Nigerian princes and you really will get paid. With further ado, here are our 32 legitimate ways to earn extra cash from home. Number 1. Earn cash while watching cooking videos online. If we told you that you could get paid to watch videos on your computer, you would probably laugh. It's so good to be true, right? But we are serious. A website called Inbox Dollars will pay you to watch short video clips online. One minute you might watch someone bake brownies and next you might get the latest update on Kardashian drama all you have to do is choose the videos you want to watch and answer a few quick questions without any further no inbox dollars won't replace your full-time job but it's something easy you can do while you're reading on the couch tonight wasting time on your phone unlike other sites inbox dollar pays you in cash no points or gift cards it's already paid its users more than $1.56 million. It takes about one minute to sign up and you will immediately get a $1.05 bonus to get you started. Number two, earn up to $1.60 hour working from home. We get it. There are kids to drop off to school, errands to run, and dinner to cook. So the idea of getting a full time job without flexibility ju just doesn't work for a lot of people. Truth be told, like it would be a lot easier if you could just make money without leaving the whole house. But it's not that, that's not something most employers offer. But have you considered bookkeeping? It's the number one most profitable business according to an article in the magazine. And they earn up to $1.64 each hour. You don't have to be an accountant or a good at calculus to be successful at bookkeeping as long as you have motivated a company called bookkeeper launch will teach you everything you need to it's not of, of leading training courses in the field and they even give you the first three classes for free it's helped thousands of people launch their own mini businesses including daniel honan a military veteran and former painter who's in his early 30s he never considered starting his own business but he signed up for bookkeeper launching and now he's making fifty thousand dollars a year keeping track of business expenses for his 10 clients it only took him three minutes to get started taking one class a week oh and he makes his own schedule earns up to sixty dollar an hour and is able to spend more time with his wife than ever if you're just a little curious, you must have to submit your email address here to take the first free classes. Number 3. Get up to $1.500 in free stock. If you feel like you don't have enough money to start investing, you're not alone. But guess what? You really don't need that much. And you can even get the free stocks if you know where to look. Whether you are got $1.5, $1.100 or $1.800 to spare, you can start investing with Robin Hood. Yeah, both probably hear of Robin Hood, both investing beginners and bros love it because it doesn't charge commission fees and you can buy and sell stocks for free. No limits, plus it's super easy to use. What's the best then? When you download the app and found the account, Robin Hood drops a share of free stock into your account. It's random, Oops. so that stock would be worth anywhere from $5 to $500. A nice boost to the help you build your investment. Number four, see if you can get more money from this company. Here's a deal. If you're not using aspiration debit card, you're missing out on extra cash. And who doesn't want extra cash? Yep, a debit card called aspiration gives you up to a 5% back every time you swipe. Need to buy groceries? Extra cash. 
need to fill up the tank more extra cash you're going to buy these things anyway why not get this extra money in the process enter your email address here and link your bank account to see how much extra cash you can get with your free aspiration account and don't worry your money is fdic insured and under a military grade encryption that's nerd talk for this is totally safe number five search your wallet and cash in your dollar bills specifically dollar bills with strange serial number ones that aren't easy to come by the collectors at coolserialnumber.com will pay you big bucks if you have a bill with a rare sequence in your wallet turned out antique coins aren't the only currency worth cash to collectors check out their website for a full list to see if you have got any there these are rare bills there's a but there's a random down of the sort of serial numbers these collectors are looking for seven repeating digits in a row on dollar one federal reserve notes seven of a kind on dollar one federal reserve notes super repeaters on dollar one federal reserve notes and double quads on dollar one federal reserve notes and much more number six get paid for your opinion Swagbucks is definitely a reader's favorite probably because of the wide variety of ways to make money beyond taking surveys. It's also famous for handing out free rewards points at random just for being a GNUM member. You'll get SBAEs for each survey you qualify for and complete that you can redeem for cash via PayPal or gift cards to a number of popular retailers including Amazon. Even better, you'll earn a 500 SB bonus when you sign up and there are 2,500 SP within your first 60 days. Number seven, search for unclaimed money. Straight players thought that the US have more than $4.3 billion in unclaimed funds. According to the New York Times, just sitting around waiting for you to come play lost and found, to take matters into your own hands and see if you have an unclaimed money floating around, Check with the National Association of Unclaimed Property Administrations. Fanny Roder, Reader Callie Howell, heeded our advice, reformed a quick search and found unclaimed money in her husband's name. He was entitled to $56 from a mature insurance policy. Sure, it's $1.56, but that's not bad for an unexpected change, right? We'll take it. Number eight, and this Chrome extension. Add this Chrome extension if you're an avid online super. Whenever you browse the net, you can click Wikibuy to get more info about the items you want to buy. Click it to find coupon codes and to your watch list. With all that info, Wikibuy will let you know if this is the best time to buy. It will even tell you that your numbers will be delivered. If you have liked what you see, click the Add to Wikibuy card button that shows up automatically in Amazon and Wikibuy places and tracks the order for you. Bonus. Your payment information isn't passed to the retailer so it's the new fewer places online. You also have the option to link a credit or debit card and then credits while you shop. You can use your credits to buy things through Wikibuy. After a simple free install, browsing a checkout takes two clicks and your savings is instant. You can close your million Chrome tabs now. You're welcome. Number nine, get $5 to invest in companies you care about. It's no brilliant secret that investing can make a smart way to make money. Sometimes, though it feels restricted to few wealthy alike, but Stash is different. This app lets you start investing with a little as $5 and for just a dollar one monthly fee for balances under $5,000. Stash crushes investment from professional fund managers and investors and lets you choose where to put your money. But it leaves the complicated investment terms out of it. You can just choose from a set of simple protocols reflecting your beliefs, interesting, and goals. Bonus. Right now, the penny hoarder is teaming up with Stash to give you an extra $5 after your first investment. Number 10. Getting paid for taking pools. What did you think of new Spider-Man movie? Is it a hot dog, a sandwich? Who's your favorite real housewife? 
The research company, MyPoint, has paid people over $236 million to answer pool questions like that over the past 23 years, and they are currently recreating new pen list. You can do it right on your phone and you'll earn a $5 bonus when you sign up and complete your first 5 pools. Any extra money you can put toward your credit cards is good in our book, but in this editor opinion, not a hot dog is not a sandwich. Number 11. Copy this strategy to keep checks in mail totaling $526. Remember, while getting the mail was fun, now it's just bills and well packed envelopes. But for Colin Rice, check Checking the mail minute, finding checks for doing nothing, seriously. Since she started using a free website called Rakuten, she received $526. Rakuten has the hookup with just about every online store you shop, which means it can give you a kickback every time you buy a toilet paper on Amazon. Even book the flight home for Thanksgiving. Rice says she uses Rakuten for thinking using already has to buy like rental cars and flights. She has used this money she earned to help her pay for her recent cross-country move. It takes less than 60 seconds to create a Rakuten account and start shopping. All you need is an email address then you can immediately start shopping your go to stores through the site. Plus, if you use Rakuten, you need to earn money back within the first 90 days of signing up. It will give you an extra dollar ten on the first check it sends you. Simply talk about money for nothing. Number 12. Turn your junk mail into a cash. You know all those flyers and advertisements you get in the mail each day, the ones you never wanted but have no idea how to opt out of all. Well, you can turn them into cash. The Small Business Knowledge Center is a market research company that wants to get a peep inside your mailbox. Join its consumer panel and start shoveling that junk mail into a post page spade envelope and at the end of each week send it over to SPK Center. No, you won't be rolling into an extra cash but you can earn up to $1.20 every 6 to 10 weeks. Number 13. Trade your grocery receipts for cash. We all want to save money on our groceries. What we don't want to do is put a ton of work into it. If this sounds like you, someone who just wants to get in and out of the store and save money without doing much thinking, there's an app we recommend. It's called Labota, L-B-O-T-T-A, and it gives you cash back for buying certain items at the grocery store. Before you shop, research for items on your shopping list without within your Ebocha app. When you get home, snap a photo of your receipt and scan the items pro codes. Bam! Cash back. Labota is free to download. Plus, you'll get a $20 sign-up bonus. Here's how to get it. Create an account, shop like you normally do, and snap a photo of your receipt. If you redeem 10 offers within 14 days, you'll get that $20 bonus. Number 14. Spend $5 to own a piece of Amazon or Google. Take a look at the Forbes richest people list and you'll notice almost all the billionaires having one thing in common. They own another company. But if you work for a living and don't happen to have a millions of dollars lying around, that can sound totally out of reach. That's why a lot of people use the Accorns app. It lets you be a part of something that's normally exclusive to the richest of the rich. Buying pieces of other companies for as little as $5. And with the recent sell off in stocks, you might be able to buy them for cheaper than earlier in the year. That's right, Accorns allows you to invest in a bundle of well known companies, letting you own a little of each of them while spending as little as $5. The best part of it? When these companies profit and issues divideness, you can profit too. It takes 2 minutes to sign up. Plus, Accorns will give you a 5 sign up dollar bonus once you make your first investment. Number 15. Create an online course. You don't need to experience or a degree to make money teaching an academy. 
if people want to learn what you have to teach, you can create a potentially profitable video course at home. Curious? Learn more about it on how to create a Udemy course. Number 16. Sell your crafts, vintage, finds and even project supplies. If you're creative enough, you can make some decent money selling your work through Etsy. Although there are some fees including a 5% transaction charge, the marketplace connects you with more than 33 million buyers globally. That's a whole lot of potential customer. Even if you aren't creating a masterpiece paints or elegant jewelry or adorable baby clothes, you can still make money through the platform. For example, one penny harder contributes Janty Barry Johnson made about $200 a month selling neat little crafts, kids, and patterns. Maybe you are more of vintage type, adventures through flea markets and even eBay to find in vintage items you can fix up and resell through the platform. Number 17. Startup Blog The startup costs for blog are minimal. Just secure your domain, name, and hosting. Only $2.95 a month from Bluehost. You will need to write some quality content to get into WordPress or your blogging platform of choice and start sharing it through social media. Once you feel comfortable, you can monetize your blog through Google AdSense and affiliate programs for some nice passive income. Number 18. Make your own schedule as a data entry clerk. Data entry isn't the best paying work from home job, but it is one you can do with few skills or previous experience. All you need is a solid internet connection and a computer, and you must be at least 18 years old. Pay ranges on a per hour or per project basis. Typically, you can pick up jobs as frequently as you would like through freelance booker sites like Smart Crowd and Clickworker. Number 19. Write and sell on ebook. If you are a subject matter expert or have an intriguing life experience, you can write a book. But there is no need to send it off to all the major publishing houses in New York City. You can self-publish ebooks through Amazon's Kindle Direct Publishing Platform. Write Steve Gilman wrote a book in a week. Yep, ebooks don't have to hundreds of pages long. Gilman found many books as short as 6,000 words. After publishing on Amazon, he started making $350 a month. The best part? He continued to make money even months and years later. Number 20. Get your true crime fix by joining a mock jury. Jury duty isn't always fun, but what if you could do it from the comfort of home? Becoming an online mock juror can be an interesting way to make some money. Here's how it works. Attorneys present cases to online juries as a way to test it before trial to find that's working and what isn't and craft the best arguments. You can sign up as an online juror through a site like eJury when a new case is submitted. You will be notified. Jump in to review the case and answer questions. You can earn up to $5 to $10 per case depending on its length. Number 21. Do calligraphy on the site. Maybe you don't want to be a content writer, but if you have an excellent handwriting skills and a set of calligraphy tools, you can address envelopes. You could make $2 to $5 a pop just for being a talented calligraphy writer. It does not sound like a look, but book a wedding with 100 guests, you could break in dollar 200 or more for right line handwriting invites launch your own website to sell your services or offer calligraphy through etsy for example 
Margot Detimer gets creative with her calligraphy service and sells custom wedding certificates for $1.175 each on Etsy. Number 22. Make money doing voiceovers. Jana Paulson, a stay-at-home mom in Toronto, earns money by taking it to herself. In her closet after her son was born in 2013, the stage actress turned into the online acting community and kept hearing about one voice acting platform again and again. I often walk away from my computer thinking I can't believe I just made money from that, she says. Voices.com is an international online voiceover acting marketplace that helps vocal talent, both professional and amateur, find clients who need them. Twenty-three, use your type of skills as a virtual assistant. If you have a knack for organization and communication, you must might make the perfect virtual assistant. These days, you don't have to buy to be the busy corporate assistant you see in old movies or on TV. You can work right from your coach. Folks will you pay you to help schedule their work, answer emails, update their website, run social media accounts, and book travel recommendations. All from the comfort of your coach. To find open virtual assistant jobs, pursue some of these work from home job boards. Twenty-four. Sell your old books for Amazon gift cards. Have old college textbooks taking up valuable shelf space? You could host a garbage sale or sell them on eBay or Craigslist, but one of the easy ways to get rid of them is through Amazon. With Amazon Trade In, you can trade in your used textbooks plus other items like electronics in exchange for an Amazon gift card. Just enter the items information on Amazon's trade in page to see how much you could pocket. Shipping is free. 25. Help make the internet better as a user tester. Did you know you can get paid to poke around on websites and test out apps? It's called user testing. Basically, companies will pay regular folks like you to offer feedback on websites and apps. How's the design? Can you find raw way around? Have questions they aren't answered? You can make up to $60 per test through sites like user testing. The best part? You don't need any user testing experience. Just a solid internet connection. 26. Become a freelancer and set your own hours. Have you considered freelancing? You can operate as a freelancer in just about any industry. From freelance writing to account to design to web development. If you're just starting out, consider finding gigs through freelance platforms. This will help you gain experience and connect with clients without having to put a whole lot of work into marketing your services. 
27. Sell your photos even if you took them with your phone. Fancy yourself a solid amateur photographer? Instead of posting all day every day to Instagram, why not turn your work into some extra cash? Start with the stock photograph marketplace like Fope. Download the Fope app, then upload your photos even if you took them with your phone. When your phone is purchased, you automatically profit. Because Fope does most of the legwork, you'll split the profit 50-50. Want to go even bigger? Upload high quality image to Shutterstock, one of the most popular stock photographic sites. Each time your photo is sold, you pocket up to 30% of the sale price while retaining the copyright. Number 28. Earn $12 per hour doing random Google searches. Search engines like Google, Yahoo, and Bing use complicated algorithms to determine the result you see, and they don't always get it right. Although these algorithms are smart, they are also prone to errors. Image searching for photos of hummingbirds only for a photo of a seagull to pop up. Or maybe you are looking for some news on immigration only to find you are reading a tablet site. That's where humans can interfere as search engine evaluators. It's your job to analyze search results and judge them based on quality relevance and usefulness and you can earn around $1.12 an hour for doing so. We suggest you start by looking at line bridge job openings. The tech company is often hiring so even if you don't see any openings now, keep checking back to Penny Hoarder's online job portal. Twenty nine. Get paid up to dollar twenty five per hour as a transcription. Are you a good listener and a good typist too? You can make dollar fifteen to dollar twenty five an hour as a transcriptor. You will need experience in the medical or legal fields to get trans assignments in those areas but plenty of researcher reports and average Jews are willing to pay for someone to type up their recordings
you get paid per audio hour. So, this is a gig that's perfect for people with great focus. If an hour-long recording takes you four hours to transcribe, you still only get paid for one hour. Listen closely. Number 30. Sell someone else stuff. Selling Craigslist free buys is a great way to make a profit quickly because you get the items for free. You could even have cash in hand today. Go to the free section on Craig's list and look for things that are to you and easy to sell immediately. They could be scarves from a job site or metal items you can sell. For example, for a quick turnaround, avoid items like furniture or electronics. These can be good to sell, but they'll take longer. Cash in your treasures by reselling on Craig's list, including them in rummage, sale, or selling to specialty buyers like a pawn shop or a local business. Number 31, rent out the clothes that make your friends jealous. Are your friends always complimenting your great sense of style? Try making money of that killer taste. You can rent out your clothing online through a site like StyleNet. There are ton of other on the market, but take sure to read the fine print on rental sites.
some don't charge any fees to the buyers and sellers, but some charge a rental commissions per order. You'll need to price your wares accordingly to account for any commission handed over to the company. Number 32. See if you qualify for a class action settlement. If you use a product that in, that's involved in a class action lawsuit, a little online sleuthing could get you a cash payout. The rules of each settlement are different, but in most cases, you'll have to provide proof of purchase or product use like a serial number or a recipe. Once you fill out your online claim form, you may have to wait a few weeks or months before receiving your payment. Post your regularly post new class action settlement information so, check in often to make sure you're not missing a chance to get paid. Our favorite work from home advice. Making money from home sounds a like glitz and glam, and it can be in a sweet pants kind of way. But there are also things you need to know before fully diving in. Here are a few resources to help you get started. If you're looking for a full-time work from home job, we rounded up 15 of our famous remote job boards. Listen, there are a lot of work from home scams out there. So, be sure to use your best judgment. We share exactly how we vet the work from home jobs we write about. So, you can do it on your own too. If you're looking to settle into a full-time work-from-home job, you will want to stock your home office with the essentials. Trust us when we say, working from a couch all day isn't good for your posture. All 
taxes you should know about these work from home tax deduction plus how to handle your taxes with your have a sidekick are you looking for a sidekick you can find those in our list of 45 legitimate ways to make money online So, happy working from home. For security is priced over $1,000 purchase of fractional share starts at $0.05. You will also bear the standard fees and expenses reflected in the pricing of the ETFs in your account. Plus, fields for various ancillary service charged by stash and custodian. The Penny Hoarder is a paid affiliate partner of stash. Investment advisory services offered by Stash Investments, LLC, and SAC Registered Investment Advisors, this marshal has been distributed for informational and educational purposes only, and is not intended as investment, legal accounting, or tax advice. Investing involves risk. You have done it. You have built up a little cushion in your bank account, $1,000. It feels good, right? Those days of checking your account balance in a panic are behind you. Congrats, you're on the right path. Now, it's time to think about some longer term goals. What do you want to accomplish next with your money? Do you need to save more? Or do you want to buy a some day home someday? Or invest? What's the next step you should take? What are some specific things you can do to take your finances to the next level? We have got some ideas for you in this video. Number one, see if you can get more money from this company. Here's the deal. If you're not using aspiration debit card, you're missing out on an extra cash. And who does not want extra cash? Yup, a debit card called aspiration gives you up to 5% back every time you swipe. Need to buy grocery? Extra cash. You are going to buy these things anyway. Why not get these extra money in this process? Enter your email address here and link your bank account to see how much extra cash you can get with your free aspiration account. And don't worry, your money is FDIC insured and under a military grade encryption. That's nerd talk for this is totally safe. Number two, spending dollar five to owe a piece of Amazon, Google, or other companies. Take a look at the Forbes richest people list and you'll notice almost all the billionaires have one thing in common. They owe another company. But if you're living and don't happen to have millions of dollars lying around, that can sound totally out of reach. That's right, you can invest in pieces of well-known companies such as Amazon, Google, or Apple for as little as $1.
the best part? When these companies profit, so can you. Some companies even send you a check every quarter for your share of the profits called dividends. It takes two minutes to sign up, plus Stash will give you a $5 sign up bonus once you deposit $5 in your account. Number three, give your family up to dollar one million bucks. Have you thought about how your family would manage without your income after you're gone? Chances are very checking amount balance whose won't last forever. Here's the thing, you should keep a healthy amount of savings in the bank. But if you want to give your family up to dollar one million, Use something called term life insurance. We suggest a company called Bestow. Maybe you have considered this before but thought it was only for rich or older people. But you are hearing that people are getting it for as little as $1.8 a month. You can take advantage of Pistow until you're 54 years old, but the sooner you take care of this, the cheaper it could be. You don't need to leave your house to get a free code from Pistow. It takes minutes instead of leaving your family with only $1,000 and a box of worries, they'll be able to afford the life you have, you'll always wanted for them. Number 4. Ask this company to pay your credit cards. No, like the whole will, all of it, well, you're trusting out over your debt. Your credit card company is getting rich of those insane interest rates. But a website called M1 wants to help. Here's how it works. M1 can match you with a low interest loan you can use to pay off every credit card balance you have. The benefit? You're left with just one bill to pay every month. And because the interest rate is too much lower, you can get out of the debt so much faster. Plus, no credit card payment this month. M1 won't make you stand in line or call your bank either. And if you're worried, you won't qualify. It's free to check online. It takes two minutes and it could help you pay off your debt years faster. Number five, get free stock. You may have piled up dollar one thousand or more in your checking account, but there is a way to grow your net worth even faster. There is an app that will give, give you free stock. Just imagine if you had one share of Amazon when the stock first went public. Today, it would be worth more than $20,000, despite all the ups and downs in the stock market. An investing app called Robinhood will give up you up to $500 worth of free stock in companies like Visa, 
Microsoft and GE just for downloading its app and opening a free account. Your free stock might be the next Amazon. Robinhood is free and easy to navigate, which is why more than 10 million people use it, including both new junkies looking to the outsmart the market and people who want to carefully put a few bucks away in a long-term investment. It just takes a couple of minutes to sign up and get your free stock. The Penny Horror is a paid affiliate partner of the stash. This material is not intended as investment advice and is not meant to suggest that any securities are suitable investments for any particular investor. Investment advice is only provided to stash customer. You'll also bear the standard fees and expenses reflected in the pricing of the ETFs in your account, plus fees for various ancillary services charged by stash. Financial investment involves the risks of loss. Today's issue is also very important in this case that, however, before we getting on the point, the FBI reports wet fraud complaints rose sharply in 2002. In fact, they tripped from a year earlier, not a surprise to the internet scam busters readers. Here are our list of top 9 work at home and home based businesses scams and how to avoid them. Home businesses scam and work at home opportunity scams rank very high on the list of the top types of internet fraud. In this issue we will focus on the top 10 home based businesses work at home scams. We will give you the straight goods on enveloped stuffing, mystery shopping, and other common home-based home businesses. Opportunities you may have been floating around the net. This is the next issue however, we will give you some important tips you could use to kick the tires of an online job offer or business opportunity. You find so you can protect yourself from those that are scams, work at home and home-based businesses scams. There are two basic types of scams involved here. Scammers using both types are aiming at folks who want to get, make their money from home. Either by number one having your work from home, doing envelope stuffing, craft assembling or other tasks where you are paid by a company as an employee. There are certainly some legitimate telecommuting jobs, but work from home jobs are often just big scams. Before we go any further, a subreading code. There are few legitimate opportunities available, says Beverly Williams, president and founder of American Associations of Home Based Businesses. Number two, helping you start your own business based business as a mystery shopper, network marketer, or other businesses where the money anyway sees is this money the scammer's pocket. Suddenly, there are lots of legitimate businesses that can help you start your own home business. We'll help you figure out which are really and which are just big scams. Our goal with the internet scammers is to save your time, money and heartbreak before you fall for scams. Remember, if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. So why are these scams so successful? If all these things do it comes down to physiology behind some makes many fast dream that ma many internet newcomers fall prey to, human ba home based opportunity scammers mooch of the following groups. Perhaps you become to one or more of them, the sick, disabled or elderly, if you are elderly, 
ill and have a disability, you may have problems landing a traditional job. Number two, the stay-at-home mother, whether you have a spouse or you're single, you may be looking at supplement or creating an income while raising children. The low-income or no-income family, you or your spouse may have just lost your job and you feel desperate and anxious to find work as the bills pile up. The person without higher education, you're a stupid or dumb. You just didn't go to on to college or university. To summarize, these scammers are often preying primarily on the sick, the disabled, the elderly, the employed, parents, and people without a lot of money. Note, these scams are not ranked by dollar loss of people scammed. In fact, there is nothing scientific about the list. It's just the 10 home-based businesses scams we find the most disturbing. Number 10, Craft Assembly. This scam encourages you to assemble toys, dolls, or other craft projects at home with the promise of high per price rates. All you have to do is to pay a fee up front for the starter kit, which includes instructions and parts. Sounds very good. Well, once you finish assembling your first batch of crafts, you'll be told by the company that they don't meet our specifications. In fact, even if you were a robot and did it perfectly, it would be impossible for you to meet their specifications. The scammers company is making money selling the starter kits, not selling the assembled product. So, you have left with a set of assembled craft and no one to sell them to. Number 9. Medical Billing In this scam, you, may, you pay $300 to $900 for everything supposedly you need to start your own medical billing service at home. You're, you have promised state-of-the-art med medical billing software as well as a list of potential clients in your area. What you have not told is that most medical clinics possesses their own bills or outsources the processing to firms, not individuals. Your software may not need their specifications and often the list of potential clients and are outdated or just plain wrong. Number 8. Email Processing this is a twist on the classical envelope stuff scam. For a low price, you can become a highly paid email processor working from the comfort of your home. Now, what do you suppose an email processor does? If you have visions of forwarding or editing emails, forget it. What you get for your money are instructions on spamming the same aid you responded to in a newspaper and web forms. Think about it. The offer to pay you $1.25 per email proceeds would any legitimate company pay that. Number 7. A list of companies looking for home workers. In this one, you pay a small fee for a list of companies looking for home workers just like you. The only problem is that the list is usually a generic list of companies. Companies that don't take home workers or companies that may have accepted home workers long, long ago. Don't expect to get your money back with this one. Number six, just call this 1900 number for more information. No need to spend too much time on this 1900 number, it costs money to call. And that's how the scammers make their profit. Save your money, don't call the 1900 number for more information about a supposed work at home job. Number 5. Typing at home. If you use the internet a lot, then odds are that you are probably a good typist. How better to capitalize on it than making money by typing at home? Hmm? Here's how it works. After sending the fee to the scammer for more information, you have received a disk and printed information that tells you the place, home, typist, ads, and sell copies of the disk to the suckers who reply to you. Like the scam tries to turn you into a scammer. Number four, turn your computer into a money-making machine. 
well that this is one of at least half true to be completely true it should read turn your computer into a money back machine for scammers this is much the same spam as we discussed in number five above once you pay your money you'll be sent instructions on how to place ads and pull in suckers to turn their computer into money making machines number three multi-level marketing if you heard of network marketing then you know that they are legitimate MLM businesses based on agents selling products or services one big problem with MLMs through is when the pyramid and the ladder climbing become more important than selling the actual product or services if this MLM business opportunity is about to find new recruits rather than selling products or services be aware number two chain letter email if you have been on the internet for any length of time you're probably received or at least seen these change emails they promise that all you have to do is send the email along plus some of the money by email to the top names on the list then add your name to the bottom and one day you'll be a millionaire actually the only thing you might be one day is prospected for fraud number one envelop stuffing this is the classic work at home scam it's been around since the US depression of 1920s to 1930s and it's move on the internet like a cockroach you just can't eliminate when you send your money you get a short manual with flyers templates you're supposed to put up around town advertising yet another harbored work from home scheme Well, that was all from us in today's video. If you like the video, then please hit the subscribe button, also the thumbs up button, and keep watching Beaming Wink for interesting videos like this one.